I'm back again. I'm finna do a red velvet. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. A sweet and savory. Hey, sweet and savory. This is your red velvet. Uh, these are the ingredients that you're gonna need. On the flour, you need two and a half cups of flour. Okay. On the sugar, you're gonna need a half a cup of sugar. On the vegetable oil, you're gonna need uh uh, one and a half cup of vegetable oil. I'm sorry. One and a half cup of sugar. My bad, y'all. Sorry about that. Um, on the vegetable oil, one and a half cup. On the milk, which is buttermilk, that's going to be one and a half cup of buttermilk. You're going to need your two eggs. You're going to need one ounce of food coloring. Mm-hmm. And on the salt, you're going to also need a half a teaspoon. No, you're going to need a teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of baking soda. Mm-hmm. Um, also, on the baking coconut, you're going to need two teaspoons. Mm-hmm. We need two, two spoons of that. And also on the food color, well, not food color, I'm sorry, y'all, I get my get it mixed up. On the vanilla extract, you're going to need one and a half, remember now, one and a half teaspoon of vanilla extract. Two teaspoons of bacon, of, uh, not bacon, two teaspoons of uh, chocolate, you know, un uncooked chocolate. All right, now. Now, on my flour, right here, I have to take my flour. I got to kind of like shift that flour, okay? All right, I'll be right back. All right, y'all. On the uh, flour, salt, baking soda, and the cocoa, y'all would have to shift it because I just shift it and mix it together. Okay? Y'all forgive me. Look, ooh, getting flour everywhere. All right. Be right back. Oop. Sorry about that, y'all. Now we're going to try to beat these little eggs right quick. Yeah. Got to beat them eggs. All right. I'm just using one because we don't take two to beat. I'm going to put the other blade on it. That's a little bit later. Just give me the egg beat. But you want to make sure your eggs are beat real good. All right. All right. Now, y'all, be right back. All right, yeah, I'm back, y'all. Now, now, also, I'm going to take my buttermilk. Mm-hmm. Pour it in there. That's the buttermilk. This is the oil. Right there with the egg. All right. Vanilla extract. And the sugar as well. All right, a lot of sugar. Now, when you put those ingredients in there, you make sure when you put them in there, you're blending it, blending it up until it's creamy. Be right back. All right, y'all make sure that after you do your wet ingredients, go ahead and put up, combine your dry ingredients. Yeah, and combine them, make sure that everything is blend well, very well. Cause you don't want no lumps or no air pockets or no air. All right. Now, y'all excuse me, I'll be right back. Y'all know I'm just, it's just me, one person. All right, y'all, sorry about that. Now you add your food coloring in. After you blend everything, Keep it going, keep it going. I have to take a spoon 
and scrape some of the sides down. And try to make sure it's in there real good. Because when I get through blending it, I'm going to stir it again. I'm going to keep stirring and stirring and stirring. I just want to make sure everything is in there incorporated nice and good. All right, y'all. Be right back. All right. As y'all see, it's nice and red. You got to keep it careful so because sometimes you just don't want to do all that splattering, but it's splattering anyway. All right. Just kind of incorporate it, stir it a little bit so you won't have all them air pockets. Ooh, I know. Ooh, wee. Sweet and savory. You're going to love this. All right. Y'all don't forget now, this month is Miss Alicia. She's been crowned woman of the YouTube street for the month of December. Okay, we're going to get prepared for January. All right. Y'all, be right back. Okay, now, after you did everything, remember, the batter's red. And, y'all, I, I didn't have no cooking spray, so I do it like Grandmama did. I had to flour the pan. All right. Now, that helps it from keep from sticking. That helps from keep from sticking. All right. Okay. Now I'm going to pour them into this here, into the pans, and sit your oven for 325 degrees. And, and, when you leave them in there for that, when you put them in that oven, don't forget. Now, y'all, sit your oven for three. 25. I said 350. I'm sorry. 325. Okay. And let it bake for 25 to 30 minutes. We're going to see the results. Be right back. Hey, everybody. Now, back to do the icing. Okay. That's the icing. Now, on that icing, make sure y'all get you some, uh, uh, Two teaspoons of that vanilla flavoring or extract, you know, vanilla flavor. Uh, get you one tablespoon of milk. And also get you at least two. No, get you eight cups. Eight cups of the conventional flour. A cup of butter. Okay. Cream cheese, 16 ounce. And you blend it together. Come out cream. Now, to make it a little extra stiff, you can add a little bit more uh, powdered sugar. Okay? I say maybe about two more cups should do it. Okay? Be right back. All right. Y'all see the cakes? They came out. So I got to let them cool. Got to let them cool before I put the icing on them. All right. Yep. All right. Be right back. All right. I'm back, y'all. Now, I'm going to tell y'all, I, no, I ain't no cake decorator. Do what I can do. Here it is. Sweet and savory. Bam. Sweet and savory. All right, we're going to say hello to Sweet and Savory. Merry Christmas. Uh huh. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes. Mm hmm. Cook what you got. If you ain't got it, you can't cook it. I want to say Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year to all y'all. Real talk. All right. Hello, P. Smith. Hey, lovely. Tiny Reckless. AJ. What's going on, y'all? That's it. That's that sweet and savory. That's right, sweets. This is yours. Miss Olivia. Hey. Y'all take care. Bye-bye.